I won the Grawmeyer Award for When God Talks Back, which is an anthropological and psychological study of a new charismatic evangelical church. And so I went and I was trying to understand how God becomes real to people. And I looked at the, cult, the way the church invited people to pay attention to their minds and bodies, to find evidence of God. And I noticed that prayer was the vehicle through which people came to God. I learned that this process was more about a skill rather than belief and that knowing God was more about a skill rather than a belief. And part of my work was to demonstrate that the skill of prayer not only helped people to experience God more powerfully, but it also changed the way that people actually used their minds, the way they experienced their senses, and the way that they were able to have a evidence that they were in contact with this invisible, powerful presence. So, so these are churches that worry about people drifting away from God. And they model a God who is intimate and present for everyone in the congregation. And one of the ways they talk about that is that you should get to know God by having a cup of coffee with God. And they suggest, you know, the pastor once said, on in, in the morning, pour yourself a real cup of coffee and pour a real cup of coffee for God. And sit down at your kitchen table and talk to God. That'll help you feel that God is present and it will encourage you to take the steps that you need to develop that relationship. What I also did was to run a psychological experiment to see if I could demonstrate that people really did change as they came to pray in the way that they learned to pray and the, the way that they and that this prayer practice changed their experience of their mind. And it turned out that it did. So it was not only that people would say, yes, um, and they'd come into the church kind of confused and then they'd say, oh, now, now I can recognize God's voice the way I recognize my mom's voice on the phone. I was also able to see that as people came to pray with the idea of talking with God, the way they experienced their mind would change. Their mind became, their inner world became more alive. Their uh, images became more vivid, more, more elaborate, more rich. And they reported more unusual spiritual experience. They had a richer sense of a God that was more real to them in the world and interacting with them. When um, a friend of mine shared the news of this at a humanities luncheon, he, said, he, he introduced it by saying, for folks in the hu humanities and the humanistic social sciences, this is like a Nobel Prize. So it's, 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 it's truly lovely. Thank you.